all, this is Piper Blush, and I'm here at the longest pier in Canada to eat some fish and chips. So let's go eat the fish and chips. It's not over there though, unless you want to fish it yourself. It's way more difficult to walk backwards in sand. But if ever I was a professional volleyball player, uh -huh, did you know that they actually import their sand for the tournaments? Yeah, it needs to be special fine grain of sand. Mm -hmm. Now you know. This is the beautiful sand that we have in Canada. As you can see, it's not that beautiful. Plus it comes with rocks. That's sand that's not yet done. and chips you need to pass the white rock uh -huh. because here we are in white rock and there's this big white rock now I suspect that this white rock is actually full of makeup uh -huh. and then it's not actually a white rock it's not Photoshop or anything it's really white but I think it might be paint what do you think leave a comment uh -huh. tell me do you think this is fake white rock <laughs> On the side. The coleslaw on the side? Yes. Oh. But you have as soft drinks. Soft drinks, I will show you. Uh, have an orange crush, please. Orange crush? Yeah. Yes. And a Guinness. Guinness? Yeah, yes. Of course. Thank you. No problem. Always keep your receipt. We are finally here. The place to eat the best fish and chip. Uh -huh. You should always go past the mountain, yeah. past the rock, past the pier. Mm -hmm. It's a bit like far away. Mm -hmm. But once you're there, that's where all the real fish and chip checks there really are. Mm -hmm. It's less touristy. Why? Because there's pole dancing here. Oh, I got it. Mm -hmm. Now, of course, they ask you for other condiments, and this is very essential. Mm -hmm. If you've been to Ireland or, well, the UK, you need to actually grab malt vinegar. It's not the same as white vinegar, though it is vinegar. I mean, don't think it's another type of vinegar. It just tastes very different, and you're going to need to pour that all over your french fries, which are called chips. Uh -huh. I know in Canada, chips are like chips, you know, like chips, but it's so complicated. Mm -hmm. And then we have this amazing piece of deep fry. And what's in this box? A surprise. Uh -huh. Ooh. Coleslaw. Because you need some veggies. And I took the special tartar sauce. Mm -hmm. Their homemade, well, recipe. I have no idea. We're going to need to taste all of this, okay? And since, well, we're not polluting anymore, this is wood spoon fork. Sp I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is. Don't worry about it. It's going to be okay. Mm hmm. This is good tartar sauce. Oh wow, very vinegary. Mm -hmm. Then, okay, let's see. This is the Alaska cod, uh -huh. meaning it's from Alaska. Uh -huh. So that's uh, a bit up north. Now, this is just uh, nothing in there. Let's dip it in here. bubbly mm -hmm. very very bubbly i mean see this mm -hmm. very bubbly sometimes it's less bubbly it's more like thick and non-bubbly which is still delicious let's try one of these fries mm. like the fries mm -hmm. very much yes don't forget to add the mad vinegar on there they have this little canteen taste 
I don't know if it's that the oil is really, really like dark brown or something like that, but it tastes like that. Mm -hmm. You can feel it. And now for the close up, because your nutritionist is gonna thank me. Always take the close up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Costa, amazing. Seriously, amazing. Mm -hmm. And then about to wash it down. I know it's not from a UK beer, but still, seriously, but different. Uh, and if you brought the kids, ah. Uh, this is the best spot in White Rock to eat your fish and chips over the mountain. All that is left is a little bit of coleslaw because it was a huge amount of coleslaw. But I'm gonna put it in the fridge for one or two days and remember this awesome fish and chip that I had at White Rock, British Columbia. If you wanna come here, well, just Google it. I'm not super easy. Well, you Google me and you subscribe to my channel. Now, all of this was deductible. Why? Because I did a review on where to eat the best fish and chips in White Rock. Oh, yeah. Montgomery's Cottage Lunch. Mm -hmm. Come here for lunch. Here in British Columbia, the psychics, they read your ice cream, not your tea. Told you 